ओपेन शॉर्ट वीडियो एडिटर दिस इज द फ्री वीडियो एडिटर नो वाटर मार्क विल बी देयर इन योर वीडियोज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट फ्री ओपन शॉर्ट ओपन सोर्स वीडियो एडिटर एजेंडा ऑफ दिस वीडियो introduction of uh, open shot free video editor its uh, interface and uh, understanding its concept or how to edit through the some practical implementation now first understand the interface of the open shot video editor you can download this video editor uh, from the uh, uh, using any of the um, um, browser and right there the in the search menu the open shot video editor download and you will get that and download it and uh, uh, install it so it is very easy so this is the uh, first uh, screen or interface of the video editor this is the free of cost video editor there uh, you don't have to pay any money for that this video editor and it is the one of the best video editor available free of cost now uh, first understand uh, the different parts of this uh, video editor so this part this part is for uh it will display the video it will display your video and this uh, this is the file menu uh, and this is the different menus there file menu new project if you want to create a new project then new project if you already stored some project is there then you can open it and if recent projects are there then you can so i have uh, different types of uh, projects there i am using this software for my youtube videos and it is very easy to handle so this is the and then uh, the save project is there save project is different between that if the project is already saved then it will uh, be saved in that name and if you want to save it in uh, with another name then you can use the save project as and you can import the files that is uh, the, all the files will uh, you can get here and uh, any two profiles you can choose so profiles means uh, for youtube or other things uh, different types of profiles there so import <coughs> the project and export project so this is the important part that uh, after uh, creating the video uh, after editing the video you have to export it and it will <coughs> create the mp4 or any uh, other extensions file now uh, this is the for uh, redo and undo suppose uh, after <coughs> at the time of process uh, editing uh, something is wrong is there then you can undo it or redo it and uh, this is the title so in between uh, the video if you want to display some title in, in animated form or without animation you can do it and <coughs> view uh, uh, you can view the uh, this uh, this is for the uh, view of the full screen uh, view of this uh, interface so you can be it view it in normal way or advanced view freeze view all these things are there full screen view is there so uh, all these things uh, <coughs> and this place is for uh, it will show all your videos uh, you can import here all the videos which you want uh, which you will, uh, is required for editing or uh, which you want to uh, edit and this is the important part uh, this is the project files and different different transaction effects are there and this part is for and uh, this is for uh, Uh, creating the uh, this uh, timeline uh, creating the new timeline or adding the new time and this this adds the two videos so if it is the disabled then uh, two videos there will be a gap between two videos so when <coughs> it is displayed and then in between that gap it will display the black spot so <coughs> move the that black spot and this is the important uh, most important thing that is the uh, uh, cut and the editing cut, uh, cutting the source uh, person the raw video to some person if you want to remove some person and then this is used and this is the <coughs> this is the use for different types of so this is the basic 
and uh, this is this is the important part also this is the timeline so it will show you uh, the timeline of the video and uh, which portion you want to delete and this time these things are used so <coughs> this is and uh, this uh, timeline uh, gap you can change and now you can see that uh, this is the 15 second gap you can change it to 6 uh, 10 seconds also this is the 10 second and now if the video is very big then you uh, increase the timeline okay so this is the things uh, <coughs> now uh, we learn how to edit a uh, document so for for that we have to uh, import some videos so import videos there and we have some videos there and uh, we'll import some of these videos and uh, see and uh, for the editing purpose you have to drag it to the timeline area timeline area and then drag it to the next to the next timeline area okay now now uh, next uh, thing i want to show you uh, how to uh, cut a portion of the video so first we have to display this video display this video now you can see that this uh, this video is raw video and different uh, unnecessary things are there so audios are unnecessary they are different uh, <coughs> unnecessary portion is there so i want to cut some portion of this video so for uh, <coughs> uh, cutting some portion of the video this tool is used now you have to see that uh, how much portion you want to delete suppose i want to delete this portion up to this portion up to this portion Now uh, move the uh, pointer, this uh, <coughs> pointer to that part, and then uh, click here and uh, uh, in the proper position, click uh, it again, <coughs> and you can see that uh, the video is split in two parts. So um, the part which you want to remove, click there, and then press the delete button. It will be removed. Now you can see uh, the video. So this portion of the video, you are not getting that portion. So unnecessary, some of the unnecessary part is removed. Now one thing is that, uh, you, suppose I want to remove from the middle of the uh, portion. Suppose I want to remove I want to remove some part of this video so uh, <coughs> to remove just click here and again click up to the portion which you want to remove now suppose I want to remove that this portion up to this portion and now just uh, click the sort in the timeline so now click here and press the delete button so this portion is again from the middle of the video you can remove or from the end of the video you can remove now you can see that that this this is the, the that portion is removed so any of the portion you can remove very easily by using this uh, <coughs> button so now uh, now i want to remove the audio part of this video so how you can remove the audio parts just uh, press here uh, and just <coughs> press uh, uh, the video and uh, place the right mouse button and then separate video uh, use the separate video option and then use the same clip, simple uh, single clip or a multiple clips so now you can see that and the audio is uh, separated here you can see here and now go there and delete it so now you can see that uh, the video uh, without the audio part now you can see that the, that video is does not consist of the audio part
audio is removed now you can add uh, the uh, separate audio there uh, you can use the voice overs there or you can use the some musics there you can add the audio so <laughs> you have learned uh, that is how to cut a portion of the video and uh, how to remove the audio now learn how to uh, add a title now this portion audio is there you can see that this portion audio is there so suppose i want to remove the audio of this person also then uh, just again uh, right click here and uh, go to the audio portion uh, separate audio and then again uh, click it single control now you can see that the audio part is uh, in the in the next uh, track and just delete it now you cannot you will not get the audio portion there you can see that no audio is there so it is very easy to remove the audio now now one thing is uh, very important that if you want to add some title there then you can add the titles there by using this portion so uh, title portion is there <coughs> and uh, the title uh, uh, press the title button and it will create a new title for the a new file for the title so different types of titles uh, um, uh, are there you can use any of the title now suppose i want to use this uh, this this and uh, now write the uh, file title name you can give the name so suppose the name is title 1 and uh, the line it will display so i want to display the now next part is um, how to uh, how to save the project so you can save it uh, and then um, uh, that is the export project so at the end we have to at the end we can export the project and uh, next uh, you can also insert images also there okay so you can add image there and different types of image you can add now how to add two videos there or transition effect so this is the second video now this is the second video so uh, you can add these videos two videos and uh, this is the transition effect so now <coughs> you can see that two videos will come together okay. so this video also consists of some of the audios you can remove the audio you can remove you can remove the project
so you can add to reduce there and uh, then even you can make that then you can uh, add any type of transition suppose this transition i want to use here so you can see the transition in between two videos now we can see the transition is there so if this transition is very big then you can make it small you can add audio also just uh, press the plus button to import the audio and uh, i have one audio in my desktop so this is the audio now you can add audio also to just uh, give it to in another track paste it to another track now suppose i want to add it in track number that is slow motion or fast motion so right click uh, on the video and go to the time option and then uh, suppose i want to make it slow so suppose 1 by 8 that's now run it you can see that the video is moving very slow now undo this and suppose i want to move it fast now we can go to the time slot and uh, go to um, fast and then suppose i want to move it like this now you can see the video is moving very very fast so in this way you can <coughs> make the video to <coughs> in the slow motion or fast motion subscribe the channel
if this video is informative to you thank you